Large language model is awesome whether you are working on digital marketing, content creator, or even YouTuber. LLM like ChatGPT, Llama, and Mistral are able to streamline your work in a short time. There are open source LLM app builder we want to show you. It put all the complex programming into a UI visual builder tool, allows you to customize large language model with a workflow node diagram. All you have to do is drag and drop difference functions and pre-configurate the AI model and perform task for you. The beauty of it with no code. Flow Eyes AI with a brilliant design of orchestration workflow by nodes to simplify coding and technical to develop LLM apps for specific purpose. It is based on Langchain as the backbones to create AI agents as your assistant. You can easily deploy the app by just embed a slip of JavaScript code onto your web page. And the best thing, it is not only support OpenAI ChatGPT, you can connect all kinds of open source LMs or embedding vector databases for data intelligent. Let's dive right into it. Flowize is really awesome that it allows you to design how your AI app run by using a workflows node based diagram by drag and drop nodes and connect it. And this is very similar like Comfy UI node based AI tool and you can drag and drop all nodes on top of it. They have a menu on the top left here. And then after you pop up the menu, you can select the function that you want. All the features that you can connect large language model like chat GPT. And then you can connect the chat data, the open AI into this conversations chain, uh, processing all the chatting history that you can going through like this demo here. So it's very intuitive way to create your own apps. Whether you have your own website, you want to have an AI customer service and you can use that and then connect with your knowledge base like some FAQ for your e-commerce store. You can connect those with the data, then use that data for a large language model to analyze it and then eventually the AI can perform customer support conversation. Now it is very easy to install. All you can do is just fill commands, command prompt, and then you can install this and then you can start this AI tools. And as we said, this is all built for uh, specific agents for assistance for you. Like this one, uh, they schedule booking a meeting for an appointment of a certain time. That is very typically most of the workflow that they can apply in the real environment right now. Talk about applying in the real environment they have in API or SDK or just embed JavaScript available for you to deploy your AI apps. Now, for all the language model, they are supporting not only the ChatGPT, they also able for you to connect with Hugging Face, a lot of larger language model you can download. Also, Olama or your local hosted AI models. You can connect with server hosting AI models, such know you upload and deploy in Amazon Cloud Server or Microsoft Azure, or Google Cloud Server. And here is the very typical use case like product category. The AI perform a web scraping and then try to help you to make product descriptions or any kinds of product pricing you want to set and can help you to do the decision making. And one of the very cool thing is that you can directly connect with your SQL database with this workflow and after that, you can execute in a chatbot manner to inquiry any data from your database. And one of the very good features that I use, it is the customer support in your website. Like for example, you have this chatbot on your website in e-commerce store, and you have all the FAQ predefined already by your company. AI understand your information and then they have a chat memory through your dynamic database to store as knowledge then prepare to answer if a new customer inquires a similar question. Now let's go to set up one in local computer. So the first time you install Flowwise AI, there are a few commands you have to do. You, there will be a bunch of dependency libraries that you have to install in the environment. And I have a script for Windows and Linux to just one click and execute this. I will attach that in my Patreon post for using this Flowwise AI and one click execute it and install everything for you. So after installations, it will be boot up the Flowwise AI web UI interface here. 
So as you can see, I have create one workflow. It's called blog post. So actually, this is a blog post workflow generally for bloggers, content creators that using LLM to search related information through internet. And then you can create topics and LLM will help you to write an outline for your articles. And based on your articles, you can do further details on each outline in content. And right now I'm using the LM studios. So in this note, I'm using the chat local AI and I'm using the LM studios embedding the Mistral AI models. And then I have a prompt template to say that predefined the AI is a useful assistant for blocking. And here's the LLM chain for connecting everything working together. So you can write on the top corner, there's a save button in here. And then you have configuration settings button for all the detailed settings of this workflow. You can do a starter prompt in the beginning of loading the page. The AI will have uh, starting questions or any gathering sentence here. So also in here, uh, you can see the history of what I have with the conversations with the AI workflow here. It's pretty nice that they um, have a record of chat history and then you can duplicate this chat flow. You can uh, using other analysis chat flow in here to see if you have any improvement or things to do it. So how do you deploy? Uh, this is very simple. You click that button, visit the save button here. It will pop up windows and you can embed this in your website or use an API to connect this workflow. So the most common thing I am using this is the full page HTML here. Uh, you can copy this HTML code and paste it on your website or any um, web pages that you are using. I want to use this AI workflow to work with you. So you have also the URL for calling and also JavaScript for embedded in your web page as a JavaScript, or you can use Python as backend server coding for your API of this workflow as well. So this is pretty intuitive design of making our AI agents for your applications. And even you can build a new AI app from scratch using this. And here we have some template on their marketplace tab here, and you can just click each template. You can preview what kind of functions or features they have for this template. And once you like it, you can just click the purple button to use template and you can get start to modify the template with your own settings in the machine. Now there's very much all things cover in this marketplace that generally you can use that for communicating with your customer, like a customer support chatbot using LLM, or you can use that like a CRM puck in with your CRM system, or you can create a factor database with this. And the one cool thing in here is that they have connect with hugging face. So you can use the hugging face, large language model that on um, hosting in hugging face to run your workflow for your AI agents. So this is a very groundbreaking that is not only using large language model for chatting like what you usually do in chat GPT, but then it is actually integrating the large language model in the workflow as you can plug in with your existing web applications or any applications. And like this one, you can send a message in Discord. If you have owned uh, a Discord server, you can do that as well. This is a tools, so it is very uh, flexible that you can imagine any kind of uh, workflow that you want to doing with and create this workflow as an AI agent for your systems. And then right here, let's create one basic chat workflow that we can do like customer support uh, for your website. Uh, either you have a software website or e-commerce website. So I have a workflow called the basic chat here. So I have integrated again, my local LLM that I am using LM Studio to run this. And you can try this as well by going to Marketplace. Uh, you go to this one simple LLM chain. This is the workflow that is using this basic chat templates. So I am going to open up this command prompt. This command prompt is the Flowwise AI command prompt. And here I have already deployed this HTML code that is from this workflow. So this is a very basic chatbot for customer support using AI. 
And these AI agents are going to connect with my local LLM models, which is running by the LM Studios. And I defined, this is a pet product website. And this AI actually is helping me know, find dock products or dock toys for things. So as you can see, the LM Studios is running in the backgrounds here. I have turned on the server side for this LM Studio to integrating with the Flowize AI. And it's running right now to generate the text from the large language model that I'm using, which is Marshall. And then you can see this is the post template, the prompt template. And um, here's the result of the demo page here that I defined that I want a Doc Toys product's name. And then the large language model helped me to generate a list of toys, products, brand name, actually. For me, as a reference or as a recommendation for me to get started and also i'm asking for cat toys and then as you can see this lm studio is working in behind uh generating all the recommendations and then you throw back to this workflow and then for me this workflow i can see all the cat related names uh for cat products uh then i can have a recommendation for this so yeah this is a very intuitive way and for this chatbot, is not only this simple. So for this example, I'm just demonstrating in a basic, simple workflow that is. But then you can actually connect with your CRM. You can connect with your company internal system to do, if you have a private GPT, you can do a local documentations knowledge base that built on this models and then connect that models into a workflow like this. And then you can build a workflow like this that based on your documents, your internal servers, knowledge base, and then that is called embedded vector database. Then it turns to user-friendly workflow and deploy that into your internal system for your employees to work on this. So as you can see, this marketplace is basically, they have so many templates for you to play with. You can try this if you have ChatGPT, OpenAI, API, Key, then of course you can use that to connect with your chat GDP account. But for me, I don't like to demonstrate uh, with chat GDP in here. Um, I prefer to use local LLM to do a demonstration. So that is what it is. So yeah, test it guys. This is a very cool thing. And in this template as well, you can throw in uh, CSV files and communicate with uh, chat GPT as well. There's many ways, uh, well, you can replace that open AI into a chat local AI, like my example here. So the local AI art for me is connecting with this LM studios and yeah, you can connect with other local hosting AI system if you are not using LM studios and that is very flexible. So yeah, that is it for this tutorial. And I hope you guys get inspired by using this intuitive node-based workflow creation for AI agents that can integrate it in your existing system. Or also you can build a brand new AI app on this workflow system via Flowwise AI. So I will see you in the next videos. Take care and have a nice day.